Alrighty, YouTubers, here we go again. It is Friday. Hope everyone had a good day so far. Everybody is safe. We have another special unboxing video to do today. This is coming from my good friends over at TVLiftCabinet.com. Factory Direct TV Lift Cabinet. So they got a lot of cool cabinets to choose from. They also have these. TV Lift Mechanicism. Hope I said that right, but uh, this is the uh, 2500 LA TVLiftCabinet.com. Check them out and see what goodies they have to offer. But we're gonna do the install, all that good stuff, all in this video. So grab some popcorn, and if you see this one you like, all you gotta do is add it to your cart, check out, and it'll be shipped to you. Now this for I think like 40 inches and lower but they got different sizes one also they got for like the beds so really cool we're gonna do a video once I uh, open it up more I'll show you their video they have there we go here Here we go. Do a little lift. Nope, I missed a few spots. Shoot. Okay, over here. There we go. I got my thumb stuck. Here we go. Do do do. Bada boom. Oh boy. They got some goodies in here. This is a uh, Bluetooth, so there's an app you're going to have to download. And I'll show you guys how to download it. All that good stuff. Oh boy. Here we go. Must be the power cord. We got some goodies. Well packaged, that's for sure. Okay, we got that out of the way. Okay, that's in there good. Hold on one sec. Alrighty guys, we got it out of the big old box. Here we go. So we have one radio frequency remote control. That is really cool. Right here is the remote. Up and down. And then next we're going to have, you're going to need a screwdriver, which is not included, uh, two zip ties, TV mounting bracket, a manual control box, lower mounting bracket, 12 times wood screws, and that's all is included for that. But I'll show you the video of how to install it on the cabinet, but I'm going to do it a little different, I think, because... Uh, don't have any uh, like a piano type cabinet so if you guys got one of those would work amazing with this but uh I don't but I'm gonna do it kind of like this it's gonna uh, bolt it on something and then back and put the TV there and it'll lift up and look down so really cool especially when you're like a college dorm or a small apartment condo or trailer this would be perfect to have so I can save some room now let's take a look at the uh, sensor, I think this was, or control thingy. This should be pretty simple. But in case not, I might have to get my friend over to install it if I can't figure it out. But I should be able to figure this out. So 
And here we go. Oh, that's where the uh, TV goes. There we go. Low voltage. Contact closure. Open up. Down is closed. Or down is open. Short is up. Delay. 5 amps. So I'm going to mount this somewhere like next to it. Really cool. Definitely excited to show you guys this once it's installed and everything. Definitely excited. So here's the mounting bracket for the TV. Come on out, baby. There we go. Like I said, up 40 inches, up to, I believe, 27 inch. Got that. Uh, this is a big thing right here. Right here. open there we go rock and roll ooh this is nice that's what she looks like out of the packaging I'm going to have to set it up, uh, video coming up right now, and then install, and then complete it. Alrighty, YouTubers, here it goes. Welcome to TV Lift Cabinet. In this video, we're going to show you how simple it is to install our heavy-duty linear actuator TV lift mechanism. Let's start with the cabinet first. Here we have a simple mock-up of a cabinet. You'll see how we hinge the lid using a piano hinge. You can use many types of hinges, but we prefer a piano hinge. Let's move on to determining the size of the TV lift shaft you'll need in your cabinet. To calculate your lift shaft dimensions, simply build a cabinet interior height that is 1 8 inch taller than your TV lift mechanism. In this case, we're using a 25 inch tall lift, so the shaft should be 25 and an eighth inch tall. The depth of the shaft is ultimately up to you, but we recommend 6 and a half inches to 8 inches. The width of your lift shaft should be a minimum of 1 inch larger than your TV. So if your TV is 30 inches wide, the shaft should be at least 31 inches. Installing the lift is extremely easy, as the lift is shipped almost completely set up. This feature of our lift saves you time and makes installation truly simple. Okay, let's start installing the lift to show you how easy it is. Install the lower mounting bracket on center, directly in the middle of the cabinet, using the supplied four wood screws. Lower the lift onto the lower mounting bracket and click it in place. Push the lift firmly against the back wall and insert the four supplied wood screws through the upper mounting bracket. Mount the control box on the right hand side where you can easily access it. That's it. 12 screws and 5 minutes. It doesn't get more simple. See, there you go, YouTubers. That is the lift and we're going to do an um, install. Alright, got to squeeze this in right here. All you got to do is go on your iOS um store app store type in tv lift cabinet they got a one for a swivel you just want to do the original really cool connected to bluetooth look at that you can stop it and you can make it go all the way up so in case you lose your remote you got a backup one Really cool. Love this technology stuff. So definitely check them out. TV lip cabinet. Dun, 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 dun. And look at magic. Goes all the way up. And then keep 
keeps going. There you go. Really cool. So definitely TV lift cabinet. Good stuff right here, guys. Check them out. Click the link down below and see what other goodies they have to offer. Stay tuned for the rest of the video.